Wow, 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 welcome to G Sport this morning. <laughs> wow, wow, what a wonderful day of football we had yesterday with Bafana Bafana <laughs> taking on Angola. And <laughs> wow, 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 what a wonderful score they did get there today as well. It was yesterday, in <laughs> fact, but today we feel the passion. 2 0 to Angola. It's G Sport. And it's live on Good Hope FM and live on your television screen right here on SABC3. Good morning to you from us, the Guy Breakfast team. What a privilege and honor to be with you today. So, this week, of course, you know, you've got a whole lot of Bafana, Bafana glory from last night's 2 0 result in our favor. We top the group A now. Now, here's the thing the other day, a lovely lady came to me and said, You know what? I know this Bafana thing, no? but I don't know any of the players. You know what? I understand this, and this is why G Sport is here. We are going to give you some assistance in remembering some of the Bafana Bafana players that you should know, especially going into that next match against Morocco on Sunday at 7. So here it goes. The first one is going to be a goalkeeper. Okay, We're going to go through random players that you may not know in the team. Tracy, you should start because you know so much about football. I do, I do. <laughs> and I'd like to start with Wayne Sandilands. I called him Neil initially, but Did that's an actor. <laughs> It's actually Wayne Sanderlands. He's our goalkeeper. He is 29 years old. He plays for Mamelodi Sundowns. Okay, wow. And guess what? He's from Benoni. Now, one way that Benoni. you can remember him is lots of land of sand. Ah, so Sandy it's the Sandy Lands. Land. That's, that's right. You know what that's right. What you that is there. amazing. Well, eh? Very good. Very good. Uh, our next player has got to be Tuso Pala. Now, Tuso Pala happens to play for Platinum Stars. He's uh, 26 years of age, and what's really interesting about him is that the Portuguese have heard about him. The Portuguese team, so they want to come over and they want to shine him up. And if you want, want more to cash, shine him up or sign him up? Shine him up. Shine they want to like shine him up. Shop, so they give him uh, shiny cash oh, okay. and then whatnot. Uh, a great way to remember uh, Tuso Pala is with a, a, a local term that we use for uh, telephone poles. <clears throat> you hit by a pala da. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so there's a good connection there. Thank you. Yes. That's a very good yes, connection though, especially yes. with the parlor. parlor. Together connecting things. Like the oh. Bafana supporters together as one. He's on wired Espresso so and cheese sport, you know what I'm saying? Now, uh, one of the, the sort of reserve strikers is Tokelo Ranti. And I know not a, a lot of people don't really know about this guy. Um, at the moment, he's playing for Malmo in Sweden. He actually, you know, interesting fact about the man. He's got a hat trick on his professional debut, and that's pretty cool. And he's in our squad, so we should know about him. But if you want to remember him, the best way you should do that is just think about, just dig into your pocket and say, Eximania. I get the Ranti. Sorry, man. Oh. There's no Rand here. I cannot help you, sir. And that's how you remember. Tokelo Ranti. Our next player plays the position of midfielder. Yeah. He is Opa Manyisa. He's 24 years old. And our interesting fact is his name is really Opa. Opa. There's no other way you can you to remember it other than Opa. Just look at an yeah, old man. Opa. Yeah. Opa. Let's no, go. Jeez, there's a little misconnection there with the Opa's. Okay, so. Can we move on to uh, someone who was actually on the pitch last night? Yes, okay, well, well you know what? Player of the match Stood last out. night, though. <laughs> He's a man that um, they replaced Kahishu the Khajwi, and uh, you, you need to know his name. His name is Dean Furman. I think an interesting fact here is that he started his professional career as a youth player at Chelsea, believe it or not. But um, the man is actually here from the Cape, you know, they call him the Cape General. And that's why he oh. played last night, and it's beautiful to know him. But Dean Furman, you may forget him. So how would you have a good visual? Oh, how could you forget him? How could you forget him? So the idea here is to remember a furry man. Dean Furman, look at that back <laughs> over there. That's how you remember Dean Furman. Never forget him, because he is our player, we should be proud. And uh, finally, wow, 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 we could never forget him. It's got to be... Q base. Now, Q base, as you can see there, is a man that photoshops everything for us. Uh, it looks a little bit like Stephen Pinar there. Uh, any, any kind of idea the around the forgotten player? The, the forgotten player. And we will never forget Q base there. So thank you very much for the fantastic photoshop. I remember all the players we went through now. Shall we test you? No, no, it's fine. I was ready. <laughs> <laughs> Where can you see these images, Guy McDonald? Uh, Guy McDonald, I'll see you today. And that's it. <laughs> and on Good Up FM, you can go to facebook.com forward slash Good Up FM. I don't know whether there'll be a test afterwards. <laughs> Grant Hines and Katlejo is buzzing. Let's check it out.